from 17th of July to 24th of August, we can see the Perseid meteor shower in the sky. The peak of the shower will be on the 12th of August. Perseid meteor shower of one of the most beautiful and spectacular uh, meteor showers in the night sky. Uh, they have been observed for a long time and uh, we have records of them dating back to many centuries. The thing about them is that you can see them in the down sky very easily. It's interesting because we had another comet visible to us recently. It is all through the month of July that the comet New Wise was visible to the Northern Hemisphere observers, especially in the UK. Comet New Wise moved through the sky from the northeast to northwest and now has passed closest distance to Earth. We are waiting for something spectacular also to join. And that is that the Earth will pass through the debris of another comet. This is interesting because as we know comets are made of sand and ice. And as they melt uh, during the closure to the sun, they uh, scatter this debris into the, uh, into the orbit around the sun. Every comet will leave a trail of this kind of debris on its course. They can be massive shootouts like this one that you see is a jet. And multiple jets will release a lot of these particles in the course of the movement of the comet. Even long after the comet has passed, this debris will be moving in its orbit. They form something what we call as meteoroid stream or simply meteor stream. When the Earth encounters these meteoroid streams, they form meteors in our night sky. We can see them. They appear as if they are coming from one direction, all of them. This focal point or radiant in this case is located between the Perseus and Cassiopeia constellations. The best time to see the meteor shower is after the midnight, especially before dawn, two or three hours before it. Remember you can see with a pair of binoculars the comet Newwise, which is also fading. 